Well, I wasn't going to argue. You weren't going to argue, huh? Well, I thought about offering her my car keys. Isn't that interesting? I had exactly the same thought. Great minds think alike. And very amorous ones. You know, we really haven't had a whole heck of a lot of time alone together. <laughs> You know what? I somehow sense some of your old doubts creeping back in. Well, yes. I mean, this is a little intimidating. Why? Why is it so hard to believe in yourself? You've proven yourself already. Not really, Lucy. How can you say that? Because I've never done anything even close to an oil portrait before. I mean, I've already done about... 20 sketches a page, and I toss them all. I think you are being way, way too hard on yourself. I know why Paige wants this so badly, but why do you? And what makes you so sure I can even do it? Because I know you, and I believe you can do anything. Because you have for me. Look what you did. You brought, you brought my baby back, and you married me, and you made us a, a family, and... Doc, you have made absolutely every one of my dreams come true. Please let me do that for you. What makes you think you haven't already? Thanks. <laughs> but I know, I know you, and there's a little teeny tiny piece of your heart locked away deep down that needs to come out and be free and be creative and live, and you have to finish what you started all those years ago. I know that, and you know that too. Let me help you, please. Let, let me help you get to wherever this is going to take us once and for all. It's almost what Paige said. That painting her portrait was like completing a journey. I mean, she meant for her, but... Maybe for me, too. Yeah. Hey, I have an idea. Oh. <laughs> well, since you can't paint Paige tonight, what if you painted me? I have never, ever posed for an artist, any kind of painting or anything before, so come on. Give me some tips. What do I do first? Well, I guess it would depend on what kind of portrait we're going to do. Right. I mean, you know, there's a standard, you know, elbow on the mantelpiece kind of thing. Right. Or, uh, well, we could use less clothes and do something a little more provocative. Um, well, maybe, I, I, I'm not sure, but I think I might have in mind what you have in mind. But I, I'm not sure. Maybe you could let me know. Is this, um... Is this okay? Like this? And then, of course, there's the, uh, classic nude. Um, well, that's even better, more interesting. First time? <laughs> I mean, first time being married to each other for real, and first time in your studio, decorated by yours truly to inspire. Mm. Creativity. Ooh, yeah, I'll say. <sighs> Some dedication, huh? Mm, incredible. Complete with fireworks. You know, I, I don't think I've ever seen lightning like that. I must have been busy. I didn't see a thing. <laughs> well, it was weird, because it came out of nowhere on a perfectly clear night. It was very, very... Strange, yeah, I get it. You haven't been talking to my father about little green men coming to visit, have you? Well, you do know Victor can tend to be a bit... Mm, obsessive. Yeah, well, when Victor gets an idea in his head, it's hard... not to believe him. <laughs> it's also harder to convince him that he's wrong. Doc, look who's awake. Hey, Christina. Hi, sweetheart. It's okay. Here, come on in. What do I do? Uh, well, you know what? This is Doc's 
studio where he's gonna paint. You want him to kind of show you around? Yeah, you, you want to see my paintbrushes and my colors and everything? He's an amazing painter. Wait till you see what he does. He's gonna paint lots and lots and lots. Well, I don't know about lots. I do. He's gonna paint lots and lots and lots. <laughs> do you like to paint? You do? Do you, do you want to try and paint something now? Okay. Oh, this is gonna be That's great. That's a great let me, idea. Let hey. me get some special brushes. You know just what? Why don't we put Dolly you... uh, down right here so she can watch you paint, and then she won't get paint all over, okay? These are perfect. They're just your size, and they're everything that you need. <gasps> oh, oh. oh, oh, honey, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, it's okay. Okay, look, she just has a, a, a little mark. She's a little... Oh, dear. Um, Listen, I can fix this, Pockethead. Don't worry. We I'm can sorry, fix Dolly. Honey, I didn't mean to do that. It's, it's okay. We, we can fix her. Don't worry. She's gonna be fine, okay? She's gonna be fine. Oh, Doc. It, she'll be okay. Okay. Is it, is it gonna be fixed? Yeah, she can yeah. fix it. Oh, honey, Doc. I'm, I'm, oh, oh, uh, careful, careful over there, honey. Don't. Christina. Oh. Oh. It's okay. It's okay. Listen, it's all right. um, it's all right. Look, um, we can pick those up. Duck's not mad at all. No, no, honey, I'm not mad at you. Go away. See, sweet pea, we just need to put a little more glue right there, and her face is a little smudged, but I think she's gonna be just fine. She'll be okay. We'll, we'll make her okay. Right? Christina, we could go out tomorrow and buy you a new doll. Would you like that? Uh, no, Doc, that, that's probably not a, a good idea. Julie bought her this doll, and she's had it since she was born. And you know how children are when they get attached to a Lucy, special I'm toy. Lucy, I'm a psychiatrist. They... I know all about little girls and their dolls. Doc, come on. Sorry, I guess I'm not acting like I know much about anything right now. Well, kind of not really. Christina? The truth is, I haven't spent a whole lot of time around children your age. And I just want us to be a family so much. I want us to all be happy. I guess... I guess I make mistakes. But I promise, if you can forgive me for making a mistake, I promise I'll never make that mistake again. Because I think... You know, someday, maybe soon, you and me can be really good friends. You think? Um, Christina, it, it's gonna be okay. You guys are gonna be really good friends, and then we're gonna be one big happy family. It's, it's gonna be fine. It'll be okay. Right, Doc? Right. Right. You mix blue with yellow, you get a whole new color, see? Can you tell what color that is? It's green. It's green, yeah. <laughs> now, if you mix red with yellow, oh. that makes a whole new color. See? Can you guess what that is? Do, do you want to say something? Oh, do you want to whisper it in Mommy's ear? Okay. I want to talk. Oh. What's okay. Up? Um, well, she um, she just wants to go read a book up in her room. Oh. oh okay. Well, that sounds like fun. Uh, she just wants it to be the two of us. Great. I'll, I'll just clean up here, and then I'll I'll meet you downstairs then. Doc, um, are you sure? Yeah. Yeah. No. Go ahead. Go ahead. Okay. Okay. All right. Come on, well, sweetie. Let's go. Good night then, Christina. I'll, uh, come on. Guess I'll, I'll see you tomorrow then. Okay, well, say night-night. Okay. Night. Night. Okay, sweet pea, let's go wash our face, and we're gonna brush our teeth and read our book, okay? I don't like him. Oh, oh, well, that's, that's okay, Pungethead. You know, he loves you very, very much, just like I do, and it's gonna work out, you know? You just have to give him a chance, okay? Come on. Well, we're doing just... just great, aren't we? Just 
dandy. One big, happy, laughing family.